All right, another earnings alert. Chipmaker NVIDIA reported its second quarter earnings after the market. Shares are largely flat after hours. Yahoo Finance's Dan Howley digging in deep on this. He joins us in studio. Dan, what are we seeing? That's right. We see, uh, you know, NVIDIA previously announced what their earnings were going to be in uh, earlier in August. So weeks ago, we yeah. knew that their revenue was going to come in around six point seven billion. And that's what they hit. We did not know what earnings per share would be uh, just earnings per share that came in at fifty one cents. We were expecting uh, fifty cents. So uh, obviously a miss there. And then the other issue comes down to the data center and the gaming side of things. Now, data center had three point eight billion. Uh, that was expected. Uh, gaming came in at two billion. Again, expected as per their prior announcement. The big deal here, though, is Q3 revenue, and those fell short of projections by a billion dollars. So the projection now is for 5.9 billion in the next quarter. That'll be Q3. Original expectations were for 6.9 billion. Uh, and this all kind of comes to uh, basically the idea that they're hurting as far as gaming goes, uh, and that really is dragging them down. So it's, it's the idea that people aren't buying those big expensive cards because, you know, the gaming cycle exploded during the pandemic. Uh, and then the cards that go into uh, OEM uh, computers, those aren't selling either because PC sales are dropping. Uh, we had uh, originally during uh, Q4 2020, PC shipments grew by 26.1%. Look at Q2 2021, they were down 12.6%. So a big drop there, and they're expecting sales to fall off 9% this year. So it's really just kind of crushing NVIDIA there. But still, they did manage to do particularly well when it comes to the data center. That grew by 61% year over year. So no real surprises for you in this report? No, not, not what you expected, given the warning? I think the, the Q3 is not ideal. Uh, obviously, that's going to be a, a bigger issue. But, you know, we're looking at the, the uh, shares right now and they're down less than 1%. So it's not as though Wall Street was, you know, expecting some blow up quarter uh, or that they thought that this was going to just implode on them even more so than it has. You know, uh, they had a year over year decline uh, in uh, the gaming division, 33% uh, year over year decline, 44% quarter over quarter decline. So they really, really got hammered here. And it's not just them, by the way. You know, we got to point out that all the other gaming companies uh, or companies that have gaming components did poorly. Microsoft, its gaming division did poorly. Sony, Nintendo, uh, the big game publishers as well. And the chip companies in general, obviously not doing well. Uh, we have Intel, AMD. Those are also off for the year. But NVIDIA really getting hammered uh, so far. Uh, let me see. They're down 41 percent year uh, to date whereas Intel and AMD are down 34 uh, and 35% respectively. Great context. Appreciate it, Dan.